It is a women's strawweight matchup between Carolina Kovalkiewicz and Claudia Gedalia. A Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu black belt under Andre Pedernaris. Here is the former UFC strawweight title challenger, Claudia Gadelha. When she's on, she can very well be the best 115-pound fighter in the world, Joe. This is a fighter who can truly do it all. Now training out of Jackson Wink MMA in Albuquerque, New Mexico, as she continues to round out what is already a very impressive MMA game. This girl is so good at taking fighters down from the clinch. You see fighters tie up with her and then immediately go on the defensive because she is trying to throw you, she's trying to trip you, she's trying to take you to the ground from the clinch by any means necessary. So here's the Polish strawweight contender, Karolina Kovalkiewicz, at one point worked her way into a title fight against her fellow countrywoman, Joanna Gionjacek, Kovalkiewicz, continuing to be a force to be reckoned with at 115 pounds. Outstanding striker plus submission skills as well. A very technical fighter who brings a lot to the UFC table. This girl has amazing blocking technique. She can stand right in front of you and you just can't hit her cleanly. She has such a huge advantage in that and knowing that she has the ability to block and parry all of the different techniques that are coming her way. Our tale of the tape for this strawweight fight. Gedalia is 29. Kovalkiewicz is 32. She will have a two-inch reach advantage. Here for the official introductions, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the T-Mobile Arena in Las Vegas. <laughs> Five rounds in the UFC strawweight division. It's this woman is a mixed martial artist holding a professional record of 16 wins, four losses. She stands five feet four inches tall, weighing in at 115 pounds. Fighting out of Rio de Janeiro, Brazil, Claudia Gadella! And now introducing her opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This woman is a mixed martial artist holding a professional record of 13 wins, four losses. She stands five feet three inches tall, weighing in at 115 pounds. Carolina Kovalkiewicz. You've been giving your instruction in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves. Let's make I am very fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming. The fans have been anticipating this for a long time, and it is going to go fight. down right Good. now. Good. Well, no better way to pay homage to the history of pride in the UFC with this single night UFC Grand Prix tournament. Some of the best fighters in the world have come out. Let's see who will be the last fighter standing here tonight. That landed. Gedalia's lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swelling. Level change there. Oh, and now an elbow up top by Gedalia. Half guard. Well, you gotta try to stay busy off of your back. She's doing it here. Nice punch. Moves back to full guard now. Some good punches from the top here. Switching stances here. Try some serious power in that kick, but misses. Oh, that's a good strike there by Kovalkiewicz. She missed with that jab. 
Adelia gets hit with a kick. Oh, this could be it. Huge uppercut misses. Under three minutes now to go in what has been a very fast-paced opening round here. Oh, spinning back fist for her out of nowhere. Moves to half guard. Beautiful reversal. Now she gets her back. Trying to spin to the back. She's now working from side control. 90 seconds to go in the opening round. Excellent movement here on the ground. Into side control again. She moves to back control. One minute to go in round one. Mounts again. She's moved into side control. Trying to take the back here. Twenty seconds left. Side control again. That horn sounds means we have reached the end of round one. And here's a big shot that almost ends this fight. Here we see a devastating shot landed on the ground. And here it is from a different angle. Ariane Celeste on hand as usual. here. She secures double underhooks here. Oh, nice trip. Another shot. Oh, she planted her on the canvas yet again. So another takedown. She's already landed several. And now they're really starting to pile up here, Joe. And I like the way she's shooting, too. Mixing up the single legs and the double legs, not telegraphing her shots. She's one of the better wrestlers in this division, and she is showing you all of that game here tonight. Exactly. Excellent movement and transitions here on the ground. Staying busy. Trying to pass here. Full guard. 
Look at this. Got the double wrist lock position. It looks like she's got this Kimura locked up. That is just amazing technique. It's getting tighter. She might have to tap any second. Incredible! Just absolutely incredible! Round's about to end. Sunk in that submission and got the victory. Yeah, Joe, you've got to admire her focus and her commitment to getting a finish here tonight. She wanted to leave the judges out of it. And you saw much earlier in that round, she was going for that submission, but it didn't materialize. So she didn't rush it. She allowed her skills and her setups to take over. And ultimately, she knew the submission would come, and it does there late in the round. And here we see it from another angle. Beautiful technique here. And the tap. And one more time. Nice technique here on this submission. So there she is, your winner by way of submission. That's a finish they'll be talking about for some time. Bruce Buffer now with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Gaines called a stop to this contest at four minutes, 20 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by tap out, Claudia! Well, that just might be the best strawweight fighter on the planet right there. A big win and a major statement made yet again by Claudia Gadelia tonight. She continues to make great strides with her head coach, Chris Luttrell, there in New Mexico. And Claudinia certainly put all the skills together tonight. Congratulations to Claudia Gadelia.